Welcome to Return. This is a segment we're running uh, every week to highlight uh, some of the things that we've talked about on Sunday that we want to return to. And so uh, this last Sunday we talked about healing. So I wanted to address uh, some of the pain and confusion that exists around healing. And specifically uh, because there's so many of us that have had friends or loved ones that have died of illnesses or friends and family that have had debilitating or ongoing diseases that we've been praying for and yet in the midst of it uh, healing doesn't happen in those moments it can be difficult for us because uh, we we often wonder what we're doing wrong we take on our that that kind of responsibility ourselves or we find ourselves um, becoming uh, frustrated or 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 disengaged from god and so i wanted to remind us as christians our hope and healing isn't going to be fully realized in this life. Let this sink in. Everyone that Jesus healed died. Was that a failure? No, because healing was always meant to point towards the fullness of something that was still to come. As Christians, we read and know that scripture tells us that the sting of death has been taken away, that the victory of death has been robbed by Jesus' work on the cross. When we grasp that, we can process those moments of pain, not as failures of healing, but rather as the places that God's promise is still yet to come, or yet to be fully realized. And that's where we come in. We're called to stand um, alongside our friends and family, not knowing the answer for today, but knowing the answer that's to come with all of its hope and its power and its grace.